extra. Until Luo, this batch of teal isn't any good. They're not fragrant enough when you dry them. And they get so dry and brittle that you can't even put them in the roller. Even the ones that survive the secondary processes come out at the other end a complete disaster. Are you sure it isn't a problem with the machine? Are you sure you haven't forgotten how to operate it? What a thing to say. How could we dare to be careless with you looking over our shoulders? Hmm. How could you indeed? Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. It's Grandpa Lou. Jin? Get back to work. And this respectable looking young man is. Mm. <laughs> I'm the young master of the Theum Trauma Guild. Hey, just who the hell. The, see, just who the heck calls themselves young master? This is my servant. It will suffice to call her Mini Pie. Uh, <laughs> yes, that's it. Call me Mini Pie. Oh, in that case, welcome, welcome. I guess like she is a rare treat indeed. We have been quite reliant on the assistance of the Commerce Guild for many years. But as for what's happened this year, I suspect you have already heard about it. What's wrong? You're looking pretty miserable. Did Jin mess up at work again? <laughs> you old... Mocking me again. <clears throat> My apologies, dear guests. Normally, I would invite guests from afar to sample our new teas, but this year's batch... <sighs> well, you know. No tea? Are you seriously le going to let me, the young master? Come on. <laughs> Zinshuo Zin Zin is never like that. He will say, no need to stand the ceremony, Chief Luo. We're here to help. Yeah, the young master is very concerned about the tea leaves, so there's no need to be so tied up with formalities, Chief Luo. <laughs> very well then. Tell the truth. This batch of tea leaves is no good either. They can't be dried, and I can't tell if they were bad when they were picked, or if it's a problem with the machine in our workshop. Ah, how's that difficult? Why not just use some of the older leaves you have in stock, and see if the product you get from drying them is any different? If the product is normal, then you'll know it isn't a problem with the machine. Seriously, I've told you before. <sighs> Forget it. As we have important guests present, and we'll give your method a try. Jin, do we have any fresh tea leaves remaining from all the batches? There's some in the warehouses. What's up? What's up? What's up? Oh, good one. We've been talking here for a long while now. And you weren't listening to a single word, wor word were you? <sighs> Go fetch some of the older batches and process it along with some of the newer stuff that Grandpa Lou brought using the machine. Don't you dare skip a single step. I'll be watching you. After a bit, Jane brings back two batches of freshly dried tea. How about this? I see our two guests are quite young. They might prefer snacks to tea tasting. Why not turn these two batches into tea cakes? The quality of each will be evident with a single taste. What do you think, Lord Luo? Agreed. We'll 
just do that. Jin, listen up. Take these two batches of tea leaves and make them into two different tea cakes. One cake from each batch. Don't you dare get even a single leaf mixed up. Yes sir, Uncle Luo. You want me to mix them all into one cake? Oh, for it. I can't even... Eh. Ah, yeah. Sorry for the long wait. We've got both tea treats here. Let's try them one at a time, shall we? Well, how's the taste? Mm, the first one tasted a bit strange. The second one was delicious. I agree. <laughs> Who will say? <laughs> You're seriously going to let me, the young master, eat? Maybe there's some people out there who don't who don't know how. Uh, what? Uh, what the scene shows behavior is. I agree. The tea cakes made from the tea we had in stock taste fine. <sighs> Alright, you win. So according to you, the tea processing machinery is fine. In other words, the problem is with the tea itself. This new batch of tea is just not, set, not as good as before. So water and soil. But perhaps it's the cauldron that's the problem. It's old and in disrepair, which must have offended the adeptus, causing the tea to deteriorate. No, no, it's the soil and the water. It's the elements that nourish the soil. The... Enough, enough. Let's get that technician in charge of the tea cauldron here first. It's that Fontanian. The one from the Fontaine Research Institute. Hot. Hot. <sighs> what was it again? <sighs> name is such name is such pain to pronounce. Jin, go get her, would. Jin. Jin. <sighs> Just where did that lazy loaf of scum to this time? That brainless nitwit. I was going to have him to go go to Lilong Wharf and search for our technician. Did you specifically need someone from Fontaine to fix it? <laughs> well, rather than Leeway or Fontaine, most things powered by elemental energy work on more or less the same principles, yeah. If a Fontaine engineer can fix it, so can our thermometer just... It just so happens that this Miss Oat Moon Tan Yi likes to travel around Li Wei, passes through here every so often, and loves to offer her services. So as for this round of tea children maintenance, well, it's the bit of her. So you see, honored guests, <laughs> I'm really sorry, but I need to trouble you to go to the Long Wharf and find out the mission. Miss Old Moon Tani. It's more likely than not she's found herself a show there that she can't tear her eyes off. Old Moon Tani. How could you possibly dare to ask our guest to do such a thing? Oh, Luro, you misunderstand me. Our honored guests already have business to attend to at Elon Wharf, and will just be passing along a message on their way. It's nothing, really. Is that so? Huh? Is that so? It would seem to be so. I'm truly sorry. And if you would, honored guests, Old Lou, I'll leave it to you to accompany them. Ah, yeah. Thanks for your hard work. You scared old Lewis so much he was jumping in his own shadow. <laughs> you mentioned earlier that you are here to investigate the water and the soil, right? Best you head over to Yellow Wharf then. 
It isn't far from the headwaters, and there are ruins left by the Adepti along the way. So if you're looking for clues, this is your best bet. As for passing a message to old Muntani, well, please lend a hand, would you? Give old Lou some peace of mind, so he doesn't worry himself to death. Even Mini Pi can handle the things so trivial. Hey! Why are you still acting? The show's over! And what's with that calling Paimon Mini Pi anyway? Anyway, just leave it to us. You can rest easy, Grandpa Lou. Such great kids you are. Really great kids. Oh, right. I noticed that you two really enjoy the tea change. Why don't I teach you the recipe? Oh, nice. It's time you come by some quality tea leaves. You'll be able to make some for yourselves as well. In any case, safe travels. Be careful on mountain paths and mind you, you don't slip. I'll do. I'll be mindful. Find tea full moon. How to go back from where I came from, it seems. Uh, Jin, please tell me where you were. This is the batch from yesterday, and this one is from the day before. This one goes out, and this one. Well, um, greetings. Can I help you? What are you doing? I'm checking the tea inventory. Uncle Luo and Uncle Lu came over a few days ago and asked me to check the tea inventory. So it's something about giving high quality HT to the merchants. Good HT is going to take a long time to find. Maybe Uncle Luo would criticize my choices of that I do. Sounds complicated. It's not that bad. There's simply too much tea in the warehouse. And they all require different preservation methods. Some can't be exposed to humidity, some must be kept from away from bugs, some can't be placed in the light, and some can't come into contact with other tea leaves to prevent their flavors from mingling with others. To guarantee that every type is preserved in the appropriate environment, the warehouse is divided into many areas, and some even overlap one another. Even if I knew where to look for something, it takes a lot of effort to retrieve said item. I guess so. Uh, <clears throat> me, let me see that again. It seems like a lot of information to remember. Andrew Lu was getting on in the years, so I have to remember more of his stuff. Don't make him do it every single time, you know. But I'm not the brightest spark, and I forget one thing when I'm trying to remember something else. Worse, I make more mistakes at work while I'm trying to memorize more information. Ah, and now I'm getting sleepy again. Okay, that's an uh, interesting specimen here. How are things in the warehouse? Same old. The tea leaves at me all standards are sent to the warehouse, where they are first categorized by type. Leaves are then divided into top medium and bottom quality by type. And uh, each quality is further divided into tiers A, B and C. They are then labeled accordingly and their locations on the shelf and the time at which they were placed in the warehouse are recorded. When the merchants come, we take the leaves out of the warehouse, traditionally picking some to make aged tea bricks, I know the warehouse rules like the back of my hand, and I'm passable at identifying good and bad tea. But Uncle Lu always worries when I'm working on my own. When there's a large bot batch to be warehoused or shipped, he always comes down to watch the process. I wish it just trust me for once, you know? Yeah, I feel you, I suppose, but uh, like you said, you're not the brightest. Uh, you're not the You're not the brightest mind here, so yeah. Goodbye. Sure, I have to go back to check in adventure in a way. Wait, is this special from yesterday or the day before? Alright, I'll leave you at it then. Uh, 
I won't trouble you anymore than you're actually worried about. Hello, girls. Oh. <clears throat> Enter Chenmin T words. Alright. Let's see. What's this place? That's where all the tea leaves are stored? For a tour, it's nice that you're interested in tea and you'll learn all about it here. What is this place? This is the Chowan Village Tea Workshop. Most of the tea leaves are sent here after being picked. You might not realize that tea leaves require several processes and careful handling before they can be used to make tea. Simply put, we need to remove the excess moisture in the leaves to deepen their fragrance and make them easier to store. Our workshop's in charge of sunning, baking, and then stirring them in a the pan. Some types are then taken back by the tea farmers for additional processing such as spiling and fermenting. If you have time, you should stay in the village for a month or so and wait and see the full process from leaf picking to the moment the tea is served up on tables. What's the machine that room over there? Ah, what's the machi machine in that room over there? Ah, you're asking about the stern machine, yes? Compared to our village's history, the machine is the machine is very young. We used to use we used to use a huge tea cauldron for stirring. They said it was an adept mechanism of some sort. The traditional process creates a traditional flavor. But we must also meet the quantity demands. So these days our, our workshops uses new fast machines. That said, with higher efficiency and more heat, the need to ensure quality is even greater. That's why people like me, with more than 30 years of experience... Just that, yeah. ...are needed to make sure things don't go wrong. As for Dr. Dean Jr., he's got another dictator buckling down and learning this crowd, that's for sure. Farewell, come back when you have time. Who knows, maybe you'd be interested in becoming one of us? One of us! <laughs> Alright, um... Well, uh, thanks for the proposition anyway, but... Not right now. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> I haven't, I haven't even s seen, I didn't even see this uh, exquisite chest here. Jade vine tea eggs, it's tea smoked, smoked squad. Get this. Right, I don't remember the first item that I got. That's where the tea is being infused. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, tea. Junior. Which 
chest here. I'm also getting my fair share of juicy jewels as well. It's great. Alright, the engineer, talk to me, work with me. Did you hear the rumors about the water in the soil? Yes, I did. Rumors? Shh, don't let anyone else hear. I'm only telling you, alright? There have been more and more. Uh. Sean when beasts stroke in the mountains lately. A fiend must be behind all this or something. If you ask me, the quality of the tea is drawn down because these monsters contaminated water and the soil. Okay, that's reaching a bit too far. You have no idea just how complicated it is. I think we'll need a thermometer to size the fiends. We'll find some really powerful people to settle this. you hear the rumors about the water and the soil? I'm more interested in that machine than rumors. A practical one, aren't you? No interest in rumors. All work, work, work. Uh, you're making me feel bad. Anyway, this is the machine we used to bait the tea leaves. Some of the tea is placed in here after stirring to get rid of the moisture. The flames under the machine might be powerful, but the temperature inside isn't too high, so the process takes a good while. I don't need to wash the machine every second, so all in all, this job's not too tiring. But old senior can't be distracted at all. I'm afraid I can't do his job yet. Goodbye then. Take care and see you next time. Will do. Can I, um, can I take one of them? Um, no, not that. Here. What if? Do this, switch to this, and um, it just um, you know, okay, <laughs> love fleece goat, nice, nice, nice. Um, just had to capture one of them instead of trying to fight them. Does that mean that they've been added to the archives? The fluff fleece goat. Another no, man's jade. jade. its fertility, or has the weather just not been favorable? Either way, the tea doesn't have the same flavor as the previous harvests. 
and since the, since the problem lies with the tea, no amount of additional processing with, will help. We have to serve it to the adapters soon. Oh, what should we do? And those visiting guests and merchants, how will we deal with them? Have you tried adding fertilizer? Yes, among other things. We fertilized the soil, tried water from a different source, and we've even had people uh, stationed by the field on rotation, but nothing's helped. Uh, the soil composition, jar cotton. Uh, we can rule out temperature and moisture, so it must be a problem with the soil. And you are? I am Jalkraton, a researcher from Amuta. I'm here to conduct research on tea trees. You certainly have a broad range of topics. <sighs> it's not like I had any other choice. The more unusual the subject is, the easier it is to write a paper on it. Yep. Tea tree transplantation, for example. Apparently no one in the academia is paying attention to it. So I have no rivals on the subject. It's just that. What's wrong? For some reason, the tea trees we bring over to Sumeru will never survive. After much thought, I feel that the reason must be the soil. Unfortunately, I never understood my geology or and hydrology classes. And starting from scratch now is difficult. Well, goodbye then. Goodbye. So sorry for him, but I cannot help him for that matter. Shine down. You Is another man's gem. Huh? Looks like something strange fell onto the ground. Ruin machine core. Power supply machines and discovered in the ruins. Uh, a power supply machine mechanism discovered in the ruins of Chinuville. The residual energy within seems enough to activate one more ruin guard. So this rain guard? Here? Oh no. Yeah. Maybe I'll have to, hmm, if we set this finger bob into the slot. Let me get this with the flower first. Place. You can set the charging core into the brass teeth felt with the ruin guard. And now, moss stone statue, cave blocking ruin guard. Alright. Solidify! If I must. Now you shall perish! Going on. It is, is it an earthquake? I don't know, good someone's coming. Someone go tell the boss. Nothing. Mountain King, Mountain Wong. If you think for a section that you're going to survive this, it's no good. Run! Something it seems. Online 
Please back to control your shit. <laughs> I have no need. Merchant. The great chivalrous hero. Please spare my life. I'm not with them. And just who are you? Me? I'm a... It's a long story. They stole some stuff and I was asked by my master to register them and return them. That's all. Well, since you drove away all the fees, my work here is done. I'll just get that over now, if you don't mind. A moment. No need. After all, we'll definitely meet again. The strange merchant with its it's So we, uh... Yeah. Help the merchant escape, it seems. And these guys are also here to make sure that no one... No one leaves. Stabilize! The gallery inside your cabin is super important. Okay, so we do not do anything about this, it seems. What is this? Warehouse notice. This cave is being used as a temporary warehouse. Please do not store any items here unless they are of great mercantile value. Chowan village has been busy trying to resolve its steel leaf problem lately. The number of villagers guarding the ruins has been greatly reduced. We can store the antiques we've been digging up here and transport them under the guise of being tea leaf products. Two Shan discovered a merchant with some sumter beasts. Perhaps we could use them to transport our goods. Important, do not hit the big iron lump in the depths of the cave. Do not hit the big iron lump in the depths of the cave. No, we did exactly the opposite, so yeah. Seems that I'm still alive. And well, who would have thought? Those here, though. Who wants a tea? A cup of tea, to be precise. Is it the serenity part from the adepti? Poor tea. Uh, should I? Everyone hold hands. 
Say something? And now this place should be a peaceful time. Thank you for your aid, Your Majesty. Uh -huh. And what do you say? Okay, so you say the same thing. Alrighty. Mm -hmm. Alright, lads and ladies around the world, um, this has been the discovery. I mean, the beginning, obviously, of uh, the discovery of Chen Yuville. Quite interesting to see, to say the least. I'm quite pleased. The OST spot on. Who you miss never misses. Um, <laughs> and every journey has its final day. Yeah. Don't rush. And it's been really fascinating so far. Uh, how the tea has been processed. What's the problem the soil and the water I don't know too much about this and as well but I think that um, I'll continue this part uh, in the next stream or in the next video updates that you will see from me in the future uh, which might be several hours after that one who knows boats are made for transferring but yeah, commodities back and this forth. ost specifically and those that come across Leo is really soothing on. and uh, so it is where many things come it relaxes my mind silly so i hope i'll get it in my serenity pot when the time comes but yeah um fascinating to say the least uh i can't wait to explore even more i'll do some off stream exploration myself uh, in order to to save all the things that I think are deemed important for us on stream purposes. But yeah, uh, that will be all for me for today, as guys. Mantis wine tastes the same as I remember. But where are those who share the memory? But yeah, if you like what you've seen so far from me uh, regarding all of my videos from my Genshin Impact journey, or uh, this new, well, this new opening to a brand new region. And you know what to do. Make sure to leave a like on the video, subscribe if you're brand new, and also activate the notifications bell, the notification bell, sorry, so that you never miss a video from me in the future. Also, consider leaving me over at twitch.tv forward slash forever where I do all of my streaming in a timely fashion. And also follow me on the socials, Instagram, uh, Twitter, Discord, and as all that Mantis jazz. wine tastes the same as I remember. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I'll, <laughs> I'll uh, try to keep the uploads coming, obviously. So, yeah, I hope you had an amazing time, and I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Goodbye, guys.